Hey guys, today unfortunately I have some bad news. Jojo is a little bit under the weather, so you're stuck with me, okay? Now, Jojo, I was thinking to make you some chicken noodle soup because it's really good for when you're sick. Whoa! Huh? What do you think about that? Would you like that? Wait, are you gonna buy the already made one or you're gonna make it from no, scratch? No, I'm gonna make it. That's the beauty of it. I've never seen you make it. Because I've never made it. That means you don't know how to make it. Oh, I know how to I'm make it. I'm gonna get more sick if I drink it. No, do you want it or not? Okay, fine. I want uh, it. Okay, so I just set myself up. Uh, we have no ingredients. We definitely don't have a chicken. <laughs> I knew it. So, but we're going to go to the market together, okay? And we're going to get all these ingredients like that. And then I'm going to cook it here at home and show it to you. We? Me? I'm not going. Me and them. Oh. Right, guys? You're coming? Okay, so before I go, I'm going to make you some Taki Flu. I don't know if you know. This is not product placement, by the way. I just really like using this stuff. So that she feels better because she seems really pale and not not okay. It's basically a, a medicine, all right, that has a taste of lemon and honey, and she doesn't really like it so much. I kind of like it. In fact, sometimes I feel like drinking it when I'm not sick. That's how it's weird. It's that fake honey lemon taste, but I dig it. Okay, so here we go. We just get this thing open, right? And it's really just like a little powder. And we put it there, like that. And we add some hot water. I wish you could just add hot water on anything and everything's done, right? Like the noodle soups and stuff. But not this chicken noodle soup. This one's gonna be so nicely made with love, from scratch, to take care of my baby. Huh? This is your taki fruit it looks, like, <coughs> it looks like urine. Yes. And in fact, you know there's something called urinotherapy where people drink urine. Okay, never mind. This is not urine. Christ. I'm sick and you're, t you're talking about Well, it's actually stuff. to make you feel better. We'll leave but that for- But you know, I don't like this stuff. Another it's episode. Like it's too strong. And then it's like fake. Everything in this is fake. They have drink it. The lemon. Anyway, thanks, babe. Yes, enjoy I, I bet it's gonna help me like- It's gonna help open. you withstand my absence in the house. So where are you going now? Just to the market to get some chicken and parsley and things like oh, that. Oh, you were serious about making the chicken? Oh well, yeah, of course. Thank you. Vamos. Okay, so here we are, guys. I'm taking you to the usual market, our neighborhood market that we've taken you before to get our beef and meat for the barbecues. Well, here I am. And we're just gonna get some nice, tasty, free range, no hormones or antibiotic chicken, all right? So that she gets better quick. that one with all the goodies no pesticides free range and all that stuff <laughs> all right it's a done deal that was my favorite uh, macellaio or carnicero or the butcher man i always go to him because he knows our tastes so anyway i'm gonna go home now and cook actually i just had an idea why don't we go get her some flowers? That will cheer her up. Okay, let's see what we have here. We have some uh, expensive roses, which is not the case. She's trying to get better, not to fall in love again. And then we have these and those. I think I'm gonna pick some of those there that are colorful and some of those. And that looks weird and fake, so I'm not gonna do that. So while my guy prepares that, I gotta figure out how I'm gonna take those roses with me on the scooter, right there. It's tricky, because then I only have one hand left. Look at that, guys. Who needs chicken soup if you got this? My God, she's just gonna jump off her feet. Anyway, I figure out a way, I figure out a way how to do it. I'll just put it on the bag, right? In here, and then I'll hang the bag from the mirror over here, like that. And then I'll put this here. And then no one will die, and we'll make it home and cook. What do you think? All right. Let's do this. Oh! Ah. Will you grab those? Because I can't handle no. everything. <laughs> Did you hear that? I heard the oh noise. Oh my God. These are so beautiful, babe. Thanks. Mm, I'm so glad you cute. liked them because they didn't have any chicken. So that's it's what you get. <laughs> so you're not going to make the chicken No, soup? we're going to eat flowers and we're going to just be happy with each other. This is nice. You're welcome. Thank you. Oh, I'm gonna get cooking. Oh, that hurts. Sorry. Oh my god. I we look should like, put a sound effect I look on like, it. What do I look like? 
you I look, look like, like a... hell, no? With this bonnet. No comments. Okay, so we got the flowers out of the way. We got all the ingredients right here. Take a look. So we have our main man, el pollo. Mm, the chicken, nice there. And some veggies, the usual mm, trinity here. Onions, celery, and carrots. Some parsley, some of these um, spices. And then, of course, some of the noodles that are gluten-free for Jojo, of course. And they're going to taste fine. So I'm going to get to work. This is not a cooking session, just so you know how we do things here. Okay, guys, as you can see, I've chopped everything. We're good to go. Luckily, uh, Jojo fell asleep, which is good. You want to sleep when you're sick, because that's when you get that's when you get better, actually. It's not when you drink the soup or when you take the medicine. The body gets better when you, when you sleep. So I'm just going to use a normal olive oil there, just a little bit, to saute this chicken. Let me wait for it to get hot, and then uh, I'm gonna start adding the rest. And it's pretty straightforward. Okay, I'm gonna throw the chicken in there. Poco a poco, poco a poco, poco, poco. That. Yikes. Some of these pieces are too big, she's gonna hate that. But you know what? This chicken was stubborn and it was so hard to cut. Okay, let's take a look. Night sizzling. A little bit more, still kind of reddish. There you go, and we are good to go. Okay, so while this is simmering, you know, in Peru, and I think in Kenya also, we like to take chicken soup for um, when you're sick because it just makes you feel so good. In fact, I was thinking there's this book that came out like 20 or 30 years ago called Chicken Soup for the Soul. And it was all these motivational or inspirational quotes and things like that. And it was like a best seller. And that's what I was thinking right now. Because this is supposed to be so good for the soul that you get better and I don't know what they say, but this is healthy. And I'm gonna eat it anyway, even if I'm not. Hi, babe. Hi, what you doing here? What you cooking? You've been here oh, for a man, while. She's yeah. gonna test me. Wow, why is it so long? Oh my god. What? It needs to like simmer and get that broth out. No, but can I can I taste the salt? Or should I go back to sleep? Yeah, you can taste the salt. Mm, let me taste it. Just going to leave it. No, I think you need. You see? Oh, that's not bad. So, but baby, you were doing this. Why are you letting me do it? I'm just here. Ciao. Bye. I got this. I got this. Well, would you look at that? This is created by me, Pancho. Look at that. First time ever. Let's see if I have beginner's luck. All right. So let's see how we do this. Here's this. I have this thing here to get some of the soup out. Look at that. Mm, nice. God. Yeah. Wow, what a mess. God, I'm not good at this. All right. Let's put this over here and take it to Jojo. Oi, how, how am I going to do this? Three hours. By the way, I boiled an egg and I put it in there. Thank you. Wow, this looks nice. Yes. This looks yummy. Yeah. Thank you, babe. Let me, can I taste it and tell you? Sure. Okay. Can you see me? Can you point this? Can you point to the food? <laughs> I actually can't even see. I have this thing backwards. That's nice. Yeah. Mm -hmm. That's a lot of noodles, though. I know. I know. And not enough soup. No, the soup is okay. Then you put an egg. I've been waiting for this for how long? I've even got Two and a half hours. <laughs> yes. This is nice. Mm-hmm. There's our flowers. Didn't go away. I appreciate it. needs a bit of salt. Can you maybe bring me some salt? No problem. That's, you know, not a big deal. So thanks guys for sticking with us. It's been, uh, we had other plans actually I for you. I know the kitchen looks crazy. I don't even want to go in there. Every time Pancho cooks, the kitchen, everything is everywhere. The pots are under the table. And the anyway, like I was saying, <laughs> thanks for joining us. Love you.